And now you've got some things to yes, announce. Yes, yes, we'd like to announce uh, some birthdays here. Who's having a birthday? Here's having a birthday here. All right, so uh, in no particular order, we have uh, Tiffany having a birthday, Tiffany. And Jana, Jana, you're having a birthday? Unless, if you didn't know that. Richard, Alan, and Jerry. Also, on that table up there, Tim Lennon, celebrating his 61st birthday. Only 61. Only 61. And speaking of 61, right? We have Danny Alvarez, right over there, turning 61. Is that, that's at my table right there. By the way, that's, uh, that's all that's my family and my brother, Darren Mora, with his beautiful wife, Susan. Darren Mora. Cousin Lucy Mora Alvarez with Danny. My uncles, Uncle uh, Leonard Mora, his beautiful wife, Gloria, and my dad. Where's my dad? Where is he? He's out anyway. He might be on the moon, out he's the on lobby. The, oh, that's right. He's taking a picture on the moon. Yeah. Anyway, happy birthday, Danny. Also, we have, wait, 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 don't tell me. Wait, wait, wait. We have, here it is, yes. Gentlemen, for the uh, uh, special guest from the military, we'll be turning uh, 79 years old, Robert Guest. Robert Guest, 79 years old, military man. Happy birthday in two days. And if we've left anyone out, it's still not too late. You can come up and tell Dean and he'll announce it later. All righty. So in honor of those people who have their birthdays, let's sing along. Here we go. Ready? Happy birthday. One, two, three. Okay. Danny and Jenna and Antiphony and Richard and Alan and Jenna. I tried, I tried. And those of you watching the broadcast at home, if it's your birthday, happy birthday to you, but you should have been here. That's all right. Even if you're in Australia, you could have just flown Oh, that's in. true, that's true, that's true. All right, now we... Proceed now I have to get our, off the stage. We're, yes, we're going to I have to leave, but in the new stage, I can't just jump off. Oh, yes, you can? Oh, I don't want to. You can't make me, Fine. even though I'm in the Army Air Corps. Fine. <laughs> Fine. Thank you, Mr. I'll Colonel. fly away. Scram. Thank you, Mr. Colonel DeMille. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this song goes out to a dear friend of ours, a, a, a great fellow. We, we played for his 80th birthday. 10 years ago. And now this year he's gonna turn 90. And he's still going strong. He's the host of uh, The Swinging Years. And I'm talking about our good friend, Chuck Cecil. In December, he'll be 90, can you believe that? So if you're listening, Chuck, happy birthday in advance. And we're gonna play for you his theme song, Harry James, The Mole. <laughs>
Harry James of the Mole from 1942. This goes out to the one out to you, Chuck Cecil. Thank you very much. Here's a song, uh, we're going to bring Karen Morris into the microphone right now. This song was made popular by Duke Ellington and his famous orchestra from 1943. And it talks about the, the plight of the marching soldier. This is called Hayfoot Strawfoot.
little hay foot straw foot for you. We're gonna have Kara come back and do another tune. Now, of course, we're talking about the, uh, those uh, men and women who serve in the armed forces. Of course, we're also like to talk about those women who stayed at home and served in the defense plants and building planes and tanks and all that sort of thing. And of course, we're talking about Rosie the Riveter. That's right. Are there any Rosie the Riveters? Are there any Rosie out there? Any Rosies? All right, we can do it. All right, now you have to help us out here. You have to uh, imitate the, uh, the sound of a riveting machine, a riveting gun. Brrr. Easy. So here we go with Rosie the Riveter. All the day long, whether rain or shine, she's a part of the assembly line. She's making history, working for victory, Rosie. Brrr. The Riveter keeps a sharp lookout for sabotage. Sitting up there on the fuselage, the little brown can do more than a male can do. Rosie, Brrr. the Riveter, Rosie's got a boyfriend, Charlie. Charlie, he's a marine. Rosie is protecting Charlie, working overtime on the riveting machine. When they gave her a production E, she was as proud as a girl could be. There's something true about red, white, and blue about Rosie, Brrr. the Riveter. For sabotage, sitting up there on the fuselage. That little brown can do more than a male can do. Rosie, Brrr. the riveter. Rosie's got a boyfriend, Charlie. Charlie's a marine. Rosie is protecting Charlie, working overtime on the riveting machine. When they gave her a production E, she was as proud as a girl could be. There's something true about red. The Riveter. Karen Morrison, ladies and gentlemen. Rosie the Riveter. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we have a special presentation that's kind of uh, formulated uh, in the last n number of hours. So we're going to ask you to clear the floor for this great presentation. It'll just one number, then you're back on the floor again. We're going to uh, have a special group perform for you. They performed for here before and in many, many places around. Los Angeles and around the country. And I'm talking about that troupe called the Hollywood Hot Shots. And they're gonna be performing for you right now. And they decided to pick a tune that happens to be sung by the Lindy Sisters. So we said, hey Lindy's, can you sing it? And she said, they said, sure. And they said, okay, we'll do it. So here we go. Let's bring out the Lindy Sisters right now. We'll get a
the Hollywood Hotshots, and the Lindy Sisters. And now we bring back to you our normally scheduled dance program already in progress. The song, once again, uh, goes out to our friends in Britain. The song that was sung by Dame Vera Ellen. Vera, Vera Ellen. Someone corrected me last time. From 1940, it's a beautiful song, White Cliffs of Dover. Zachary Ford. How about another one by Zachary? They love you, they love you. All right. And of course, the burning question is, are you more related to Henry Ford or Glenn Ford? Neither. All right, very good. Harrison. You're your own Ford. That's right. All righty. We're going to do a song that was uh, recorded by Frank Sinatra from 1943. As soon as uh, there'll be a hot time in the Old Town of Berlin tonight or something like that. Huh? I'll make it up. be a hot time in the town of Berlin when the Yanks go marching in. I want to be their boy and spread some joy when they take old Berlin. There'll be a hot time in the town of Berlin when the Brooklyn boys begin to take the joint apart and tear it down when they take old You know, Joe, there'll be a hot time in the town of Berlin when the Yanks go marching in. You could never keep them happy down on the farm after they take Berlin.
show her how we paint the town bag in Michigan. We're gonna take a hike through Hitler's Reich and change that high dude. Give me some skin. There'll be a hot time in the town of Berlin when the Yanks go marching in. You'll know that you could never keep them happy down on the farm. Ford, ladies and gentlemen. Look at all these tall singers. Well, we uh, lowered it that short because, of course, you know what, what time it is. It's time to bring back Chloe Fioranzo to the microphone. All right. Now you're here for, for the summer. Coco, you're here for the summer? Yes. What? Well, yes, okay. Yes, just nod, just nod. You say, yeah, she said yes. You're here till, uh, till August and it's back to Webster College. Yes. Well, university, sorry. My apologies to those who are from Webster College. So, Webster University. I don't know, is there a Webster College? I don't know. Anyway, uh, yes. So uh, she's. She, gigging around town and doing all this sort of thing. And so you're off to your next gig right after this, you know, so who knows? But again, she's driving now, so be very, very careful. All right, we're gonna do uh, a little Lady Be Good in F. All right, let's go ahead and count it out.
Thank you very much, Chloe. She's gonna be uh, gigging around town, so uh, look out for her in, in your neck of the woods. And now, folks, it's time to bring back, oh, here they, where are they? Oh, here they come. The Lindy Sisters are gonna sing for you another great tune. So how about welcome them back, the Lindy Sisters. A blink, a blank, a blink, a blank, a plunk, and on the key. A rip, a rap, a rip, a rap, a rip, a rap, a rip, and out with ease. And when he plays with a bass and guitar, say, all the road, beat me, daddy, A to the bar. He plays the boogie, he plays A to the bar, the boogie boogie. That is the way he likes to play on his piano. There's a guy who plays the best piano by far. But he plays with a bass and guitar. They holler, beat me, you daddy, beat me, daddy, and into the bar. The people gather around when he gets on the stand. Then when he plays, he gets a hand. Rhythm that he plays puts the cats in a trance. Nobody there ever bothers to dance, but when he plays with a bass and guitar, they all roll, beat me, daddy, A to the bar. A blink, blink, a blank, blank, a blink, a blank, a blink, a blank, a plunk, and on the key. A rip, a rip, a rap, a rap, a rip, a rap, a rip, a rap, a rip, and out with me. So when he plays with a bass and guitar, they all roll, beat me, daddy, A to the bar. Gentlemen, the Lindy Sisters. Hey, we'll have them back later on. We're gonna have another Hal McIntyre number for you. Uh, it's Karen Morrison singing it's called "We'll Meet Again." Right.
just like you always do to the blue skies drive the dark clouds Morrison, ladies and gentlemen. And take the A train, Billy Strayhorn. Thank you. We're gonna have Zachary Ford come back for one more song for this evening, for for his evening. But he's still got to sit there for the rest of the night. Think about what you've done. And anyway, this is a song made popular by Vaughn Monroe. This is 
great uh, song that's uh, very timeless. When the lights go on again, all over the world. We'll sail again all over the world. Then we'll have time for things like wedding rings and free hearts will sing when the lights go on again. Once again, a big hand for Zachary Ford. Uh, the limey's got him. All right, never mind. <laughs> now it's time to bring back the Lindy sisters. Sisters, come on out here. If you are really sisters. Quiet. All right. Can I 
conventional refrain And yet I should explain It means I am begging for your hand I could say bad, bad I even say When the bar each lake Which only helps me tell you How grand you are Ready Well, the people you meet here at Maxwell the Mill Cicada Club yesterday. <laughs> and uh, well, this next number, which will uh, send you guys off, will be the one that is requested from you the most. Is that correct? Tis true. Tis true, they say. And you'll hear it in the first two notes. Thank you, sisters. We will see you on the USS Iowa in a couple days.
And uh, as you know, of course, that the Andrew Sisters recorded a lot of tunes with Bing Crosby. And of course, this goes out, this next song goes out to our good friend Johnny Holiday, listening out there. Of course, we have our friends, we have Hutton Wilkinson here, we have the Oppenheimer, everyone here. Oh, hello, Jim. In lieu of, in lieu of Johnny Holiday, we happen to bring this young whippersnapper here. Jim Ziegler, sing for you a, a tune that Bing recorded in Christmas time of 1943. And it talks about that land of sagebrush and cows and prairie as far as the eye can see. The San Fernando Valley. All right, here we go. I'm packing up real And I'm deep today Gonna take a trip California way I'm gonna settle down And never more roam And make the San Fernando Valley My home I'll give my sins I'll be making new friends where the west begins and the sun set in cause I decided where it's truly ought to be and it's the San Fernando Valley for me I feel that I'm safe in Staten to be waiting when my lonely journey is done Kindly old Reverend Thomas He made us a promise It's gonna make the two of us one So I'm hitting the trail To the cow country You can't forward my mail Care of RFD I'm gonna settle down And never more go and make the San Fernando Valley my home. the trail to the cow country you can forward my mail care for if I'm gonna settle down and never more room and make the San Fernando Valley my home and make the San Fernando Valley my home and make the San Fernando Valley my home! Jim Ziegler, ladies and gentlemen. Now the trick is trying to find his way back. We have time for a, a few more numbers and uh, then we have to uh, head on out. But uh, this is our last slow number for the evening, so find your partner or a partner.
ladies and gentlemen. The guys in the band here, right over here, we have Glenn Berger, Bill Wilson, Jim Jettikin, Ron Jubla, and Martin Matthews. On the trombone section, we have, um, we have uh, Jim McMillan, Dave Bryan, Toby Holmes, I knew you. In the trumpet section, Jim Ziegler, Chris, Tedes Chris Tedesco, Brian Atkinson on the drums, Ray Frisbee on the bass, Jim Garofalo on the guitar, Denny Hardwick. Yeah. We'd like to thank Zachary Ford and Karen Morrison and uh, the Lindy Sisters, and also special guests, Chloe Fioranzo and the Hollywood Hotshot. Thank you all so very much.
Ukraine. Papa, all right, we're gonna bring all the singers on board. We'd like for you to join in this song, and uh, I think uh, this is very appropriate for this weekend as, as well as uh, as well as all time. So please join in. You guys know how the words go. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for Dean Mora and his orchestra. <laughs> Along with Karen Morris and Zachary Ford, the Lily Sisters and the Hollywood Hotshots. We hope you've enjoyed your night at the Cicada Club as we pay tribute to the men and women of our armed forces.